Members of Maine's Democratic Party are gathering tonight and this weekend for their state convention. The goal is not only to come up with a unified message, but also, if possible, strengthen their hold on the state house. New Center Maine's Caroline LaCour is at the Cross Insurance Center in Bangor tonight with more. Caroline. Yeah, Amanda, the parking lot is packed uh, for this year's Maine Democratic Convention as things kick off right inside the Cross Insurance Center behind me here. Uh, late, the convention is scheduled to go into well into later this evening and into Saturday. More than 1100 people are expected to be here tonight, many of which have been participating in activism workshops earlier this afternoon to discuss everything from improving inclusiveness and gender justice to affordable housing here in Maine and more. Later tonight, attendees will hear from the Democratic Democratic Party leaders and Congressman Jared Golden, who is running for re-election in district in district two against the eventual winners of the pro Republican primary, either Mike Sobolewski or Austin Terrio. Maine Democratic Party Chair Bev Eulen Hake says this weekend will cover several key issues of importance to party members. I think there are a whole lot of kitchen table issues that we all talk about. It's the economy, it's our education system, it's about making sure. Um, that we're doing the best thing we can for working families. Um, there are a lot of issues that we'll be talking about, but I think that those are probably top of mind. Now, uh, tomorrow, uh, folks will be returning back here to the Cross Insurance Center for a packed schedule. Uh, they will hear from state leaders like Governor Janet Mills, as well as uh, U.S. Secretary of the Interior, Deb Holland. Uh, Holland will deliver a keynote address. Holland is the first Native American to uh, serve in the cabinet. Live in Bangor, I'm Caroline LaCour, New Center, Maine. Caroline, thank you.